Hey guys, what is up? I know it's been a while, but we're finally doing our next episode of Pokemon Go, or Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. Why did I say Pokemon Go? Uh, but so in the last episode, we just beat Lieutenant Surge. Um, the goal of this video is we're going to try to beat the next gym leader, fingers crossed, but uh, I'm not sure if it's going to happen. There's quite a bit we have to do before the next gym, so uh, let's see, see how far we get. All right. So we had to run to the Pokemon Center real quick because I completely forgot that, um, yeah, uh, I didn't heal up after that gym battle. Thank God I remembered before I went out for all the trainer battles. Because, uh, yeah, Big Daddy was not dead. So we're just going to take on these, these uh, <coughs> sorry, it's still early in the morning. We're going to take on a few trainer battles real quick. Do some Pokemon's battles. Jeez, Big Daddy, why the hell are you so weak? Oh my god. I don't remember him being this weak. Maybe it's just Rock Tomb. Rock Tomb's a shitty move, honestly. Alright. So we beat up a little child, and we got us some money. I forget. Let me make sure I've got Pokeballs real quick, guys, because this is a new route. Yeah, yeah, let's catch our Pokemans for the root. Let's see if we can find anything good down in here. Hopefully we'll find like a drowsy or something. I think you can find a drowsy. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. If we that is if we can catch it without you know, killing the damn thing. Uh what do we got in the party right now? We got squirt hole, chicken pox. Hickey, Herpes, and Snoop Dogg. Oh, God. You know what? We're going to have to send Hickey out for this. I, I honestly don't care if Hickey dies. Honestly, because I, I, I hate Subat. Alright, now what what should we use? Let's, let's see. Let's try a bite attack. Oh, God. Well, he flinched at least. So after, after this playthrough, we're going to start playing, uh, I've got a copy of Pokemon Scarlet I'm going to boot up on the Switch. We're going to do some recording with that. So I'm going to try to finish up this series as quickly as possible, guys, so that we can actually get on to uh, Pokemon Scarlet. I'm going to do a Pokemon Scarlet run. Not sure if it's going to be a Nuzlocke or not yet, but um, I got quite a ways into that game and I realized that, um, you know, my starter, my IVs suck on my starter, so I'm, I'm just going to restart and uh, do a series for you guys on that one. I know it's fairly new. I bought that thing opening day. I never recorded. I should have. Alright, so we got Nekans. Awesome. And we got to give it a nickname. Now, we actually had somebody um, suggest nicknames, so I'm going to go check my YouTube comments real quick. We will be right back with the name. Only one person suggested a name, so, uh, uh yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> All right, got it. So we are naming this thing Rhea, which is short for gonorrhea, because, unfortunately, we can't actually... I think there's that's too many characters for the game. So, yeah, we're naming it Rhea, short for gonorrhea. <laughs> Thank you guys for the name suggestions. Gotta fight an old man real quick, take his money too. Oh, why the hell did I use Rock Tomb? Oh god, at least it missed. I mean, shit, it missed too. Oh no. Alright, we're just gonna use Thrash on this guy, hopefully take him out. One hit. Oh yeah. About to use Oddish. Nope, we'll just one-shot him too. Beat up the old man's Pokemans, take his money. By the way, if you guys do hear a dog in the background, we got a puppy, so, uh, yep, sorry. Puppy's kind of stuck in the recording room right now. Kind of early in the morning, and, uh... See, if I remember right, there's a Snorlax out here, and we can't get past Route 12, yep. And we don't have a Pokey Flute, so that's going to be the end of going down that route for now. Unfortunately. All right, so I, I've kind of made a decision about this run too. Since it's a Nuzlocke, 
I'm not going to engage in all of the trainer battles. Like, I mean, it. Oh, shit. I just. I had to say something, and, and now. Yeah. Great. Alright, so we got another trainer battle. If they see me, I'll battle them. But it's like, I, I don't want to uh, battle every trainer because, I mean. It, it's a Nuzlocke. It's going to take forever, you know, if I battle every trainer. All right, Magnemite's down. What's he got next? Is that his only Pokemon? Yep, that was his only Pokemon. All right. So this one might take me a minute because I forget where to go. I know you got to go. You got to go back. You got to go around somehow, but I forget. I think we have to go back to Cerulean City. We have to go get the bicycle, if I remember right. And then... Hello, ass. How are you doing? I'm one of Professor Oak's aid. I, I don't want aids, sir. Uh, yeah, look for him around Route 2. Yeah, okay, fine. So, yeah, no, we have to go back, though. I know that. We're, we're going to figure this out today. I don't know how, but we're going to figure it out today. All right, so I did some uh, off-camera leveling because that stuff's boring. No Pokemon died. Now, in case you guys are wondering how I'm doing this without cheating, because I'm sure that probably is coming up. I'm using OBS Studios to record this, and I'm pausing and unpausing my recordings to make it look like I'm actually editing the video. Big secret there. Um, so if I have a Pokemon die, I can't fake it, <laughs> because literally, I, I would have to, like, um, even if it happened off camera, I'd have to show it on camera eventually, because I'd have to be like, oh, well, shit, um, you know, we ran into a snag, this one got KO'd, but that, that's not going to happen, hopefully. So, I forget where we're supposed to go from here, so we're going to go through the frickin' cave. I, I, I forget if this is how you get to the next area. We're going to go through the Diglett's cave. I'm pretty sure this is the right way to go. But I don't remember. It has been years since I've played this game. Also, we got to be careful because you can run into like a level 31 Doug Trio in here. And we haven't caught a Pokemon for this route yet. Diglett's Cave technically counts as a new route. So, if I can get this guy down, I guess we could catch him. Or, no, we're just not going to. We don't need a Diglett for this run. We're just going to kill it. We totally don't need that. Hopefully we don't run into the Doug Trio, though. I really don't want to have to fight that thing. It could actually kill one of my party because I think it's got big. Not good. But I'm going to try and get this Let's Play series done in the next few weeks. Hopefully you guys will enjoy that. I know. Oh no! There it is. Oh great! All right, let's just try to thrash it and hope that Big Daddy can take care of it here. Oh god! All right, mud slap. Good. It didn't go for a dig. That's still gonna lower my accuracy though. That's not good. Thrash is already not the most accurate move in the game. But it looks like we won. All right, I'm about to look like a huge idiot. I'm sure there's people laughing watching this right now. They're probably like, oh, you can't get through the Diglett Cave. But dude, I don't remember. The last time I played this far into the game, I was like eight years old. I mean, that was almost a hundred years ago. So, yeah, now, <laughs> my memory's not the best from my childhood. A lot of fucking Diglets. Why didn't I level up in here? I went and leveled up on Route 10 or 11, that route we were on battling earlier. And, and yeah, I think I feel like I've wasted time here, guys. Oh, God. Please tell me we can get through. Yeah, there's a ladder. Oh, thank God. It's just another Diglett. I'm, like, so paranoid that we're going to run into one of those Doug Trios and it's going to use Dig and White Big Daddy. Because, I mean, a level 29 with a crit on a dig that would be a super effective attack. Yeah, it could actually one-shot Big Daddy. Route 2. Oh. Oh, I know where we're at. If we go in here... Yeah, this guy... Um, somebody... Okay, it used to be you could get a Mr. Mime from this guy. 
want to trade for my Mr. Mime? What what are you looking for, bud? Will you trade anything for Mr. Mime? Oh, okay, let's see if he'll take Hickey. That's no Abra. Oh, he wants an Abra. Okay, well, we're just going to... We're just going to go on. Yep, let's use Cut, get through this, and I think there's another cave down here, maybe? Or something? Where even are we right now? Route 2. Oh god, we're clear back by the beginning, aren't we? Found a paralyzed heal. I guess let's grab these goodies. This is why my wife says I'm like Zoro. I'm lost. Yeah, in games. No, in real life, too. You should, you should see me trying to navigate a road trip. I suck. Thank God for GPS. If we didn't have GPS, I, I would have died a long time ago, guys. Alright, so we have two options here. We can go back through the Diglett Cave or... God, I don't even remember where to go. I'm going to have to look up a walkthrough for this game to see what you do after you beat Lieutenant Surge because I completely do not remember. So we're actually heading back through Mount Moon again. I'm going to use the power of my emulator to speed through it, though. But, uh, yeah, I'm an idiot, guys. I'm an idiot. Oh, God, there's a trainer we haven't battled here yet. I guess I'm stuck battling him now. Oh, God. Of course, it's going to be an easy fight. About to send out Ratata. Of course, he's about to send out Ratata. I think that's all the youngsters have is like teams of Ratatas. Oh, he's got Zubat. That's interesting. All right. Yeah. So I feel like this is gonna be a janky episode. I'm sorry, guys. I'm still posting it. Like. I mean, I gotta get this Let's Play series done. We gotta get through Pokemon Fire Red. We're gonna be doing a lot of Pokemon on the channel. I love Pokemon. But I'm more excited to do my newer ones because that's actually gonna be on my Switch. So, yeah. All those Pokemon I'm gonna be getting on the Switch too. I, I'm gonna be keeping them. They're going to my Pokemon home. They're going on my phone on my Pokemon Go account. Because I do play Pokemon Go, and I really haven't done um, a lot of videos about Pokemon Go. Mostly just because, um, I don't know, that one's a little more sensitive. You could dox yourself and give away your location by playing Pokemon Go. Like, that's my main reason. Why, why did I use that? Oh, it's actually super effective. Okay. Okay. I forgot Oddish is like some janky, like, ground grass bug type whatever. Why is Team Rocket still here? Oh my. Okay. Well, anyways, we're gonna we're gonna fast forward through this, guys. Guys, I had to unpause this. We just encountered a Clefairy, and unfortunately, I can't catch it. Had to include this sad moment. This. I, I'm starting to hate Nuzlocke just a little bit. Just just a little bit here. So we're back in Vermilion City again, not knowing where to go, right where we started at. Oh, jeez, I'm just getting my cell phone, guys. I'm going to look it up. Okay, somebody's going to be laughing their ass off right now because apparently I went the right way. We need to go through Diglett's Cave to Route 2 and then go through the cave <laughs> to Celadon City. I fucked up, guys. I fucked up. So I'm a little upset right now. After looking up a walkthrough by a guy that was speaking Hindi, uh, I remembered something from my childhood. We need the bike. And to get the bike, uh, I gotta go talk to this guy. Raise more than 100 Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, let's just talk to him. It's, it's gonna be like really, really long-winded. I think this is the guy or somebody in here. Yeah, he gave me the bike voucher for listening to his, his old man story. Now we have to go back to Cerulean City. Why, God? Why do you hate me so much? About friggin' time. Alright, now we just walk in here and give that bike voucher to this guy. There we go. We got the bike. We got the bike. We got the bike. 
And we're going to need that actually to progress the story because there's an area you can't get past without a bike in this game. I found it, guys. Route 9. Only took me like three hours, but here we are. Oh boy, a, G a Pokemon's battle. Oh boy, kind of disappointed in myself. This whole episode is going to be about getting to the next city instead of doing gym battles like I'm supposed to be doing. This has got to be like the most confusing non-linear story of any Pokemon game. Like, who in the hell would think you'd have to go through all these steps just to get to the next city and then you have to go back to Cerulean? I mean, just, just to get to the next city. Like, Jesus. At least we got the bike, so we have the bike. Oh god, this is gonna be a long battle. Use Peck. Awesome. Oddish. Nope, we don't need to change. We're just gonna peck them all to death. We gotta at least make it to the next city. Time's running out on our video. We're up to 16 minutes already. These episodes are only 20, so I gotta hurry with this shit. We still got a cave to go through. Oh boy, I really, I really screwed this one up. Alright. Ooh, an item. And that was a trap. TM40 at Saint Aerial Ace. Oh, 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 shit! Now we have to do Pokemon's battles. Just use Thrash, Big Daddy. That's what Big Daddy's good at. He's about to level again. We, we've leveled him twice almost now with the... Oh, no. And he's just going to go in for Thrash because he's... Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. We got anything with a fighting move? Other than Big Daddy. Really don't want to have to play... Oh, no. Play Russian Roulette here. We're going to have to do it. Come on, double kick him. No! Oh, this is just wonderful. This is just wonderful. All right. And we leveled, nice. Level 38 now. All right, we beat the hiker. This episode might have to run a little bit long, guys, because I'm putting my foot down. We're gonna have to get to the next city. Oh, oh no, the dog doesn't like my singing. Well, like three hours later, I think we're almost through this shit. Hey, there's a Pokemon Center. I remember this now. And we did not pick up the T the HM for Flash. So this is going to be really interesting getting through this cave, guys. Let's heal up. Now, this is how I did it as a kid. So this is how I'm doing it as an adult. I do not like wasting my Pokemon's move slots for worthless shit like Flash. So let's just you know, cut right through this. I'm not going down and around. Heck with that. Here we are, Rock Tunnel. Finally. Oh, dear God. That's all the light I get? Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Pokemon. Ah, it's a Zubat. We're gonna kill it. First Pokemon of the route, but you know what? We don't need that. We don't need another Mr. Hickey. All right, he's down. Oh, I'm going to have to navigate this shit. Oh, no. This is going to take a while. A Mankey in a cave? Why couldn't I have found a Mankey? Mankey's Primeape's one of my favorite Pokemon. I would have caught that in a heartbeat. And gone back and trained the damn thing up? Evolved it? I would have been so happy. Man. All right. Oh, no. Oh, no. Somebody sees us. Well, they can see us. 
can't see them. Holy shit, there's furries in Pokemon. Wow, and he's got a Kubo. Another one of my favorites, by the way, guys. I'm just going to use Double Kick. Oh, yeah, he's not a rock type, he's a ground type. Oh, that don't matter. It don't matter. Big Daddy knows we don't know our Pokemon types. He took care of it for us. Slow poke. That's a... Oh, you better not have any water moves, bud. We're just going to hit it hard and fast. Nasty. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, I oh, did so much damage. Might be in trouble. All right. Ass got some money. All right, let's keep running. There's rocks. There's rocks. Oh, dear God. Yeah, this, this is going to take a while. Why didn't I just grab the HM? Why? I mean, how hard can this be? I did this as a kid. You know, the first time I played this, it didn't matter anyway, because at night, you know, back on the original Game Boy, you didn't have a backlight, right? So, you couldn't see what you were doing if you were playing in the dark. I got to the point where I was training Pokemon. I was training up my Pokemon at night, right? By sound. I was running around in the Diglett Cave whenever I was like eight years old. And uh, I, I memorized the Pokemon cries and what the noises meant. And I would literally train my Pokemon to lines. That, that, that's, that's how shitty it was being a 90s kid. Just in case you guys were wondering. Like, if you're that old, I mean, you had to deal with shit like that growing up. There was no backlight. Your screen did not light up on your Game Boy. You were just blind if you didn't have light on your Game Boy or like a book light or something. I don't even think they had book lights back then. You'd have to use a flashlight. Another furry. Like that was before the era of the Game Boy Advance SP that had the light. What happened? Ooh, that was weird. Thrash was disabled. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. You son of a bitch. Yeah, uh, we're just gonna cut him. Yay, we defeated Pokey. Blah, blah. Maniac. Are we going the right way? We don't know, guys. Another Zubat. One fifteen XP. All right. Yeah, this is like possibly going to take like an hour to get through this. Oh my God, why did I do this? Why couldn't I just be a man and, and stop and get the TM? Because men don't ask for directions. I actually do, but we don't talk about that. A bulbous. Why, how did you get a Bulbasaur? Oh, this is where Professor Oak gave the Pokemon nobody else wanted. Like, oh my god, there's Bulbasaur. There was Bulbasaur. Alright. I think I'm going to be playing some really obscure, like, weird Pokemon games after this too, guys. Like, I think that would be fun. There was one that I found whenever I was a kid. They turned Pokemon into a survival game. I'm going to see if I can find that. It was my first survival game I played. That's why I fell in love with survival games double kick. Bam! One hit. That's why Big Daddy's gonna carry us through the Elite Four. That one's one of my favorite Pokemans. His, his stat block is shit, but I mean, Nido King is freaking awesome, honestly. Oh, God. This, this is a nightmare. That and I keep using the wrong move not even paying attention. I'm like, I just want to get through this cave. Let me through the cave. Let me out. Let me out, damn it. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Looks like Squirthole is going to evolve, guys. We're finally going to have our Blastoise. 
by the way, we've been wandering around in the cave for about 45 minutes now. So, this is well deserved. <laughs> On the bright side, we're definitely not going to be under leveled for the next fights. All right. <laughs> God damn it. 